Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. I just want to thank all the new subscribers this week and also thank you to the regular subscribers. Um, and as you can see we're at the caravan. Yay! We was here last week but did no video in whatsoever. And what are we doing tomorrow? We're probably going to be divorced by the end of the day. We're going to get divorced tomorrow because mm -hmm. we're putting the awning up. Even though we're not even married so you can't get divorced if you're not married. But we're going to go and put the awning up tomorrow morning. So wish, or attempt to. Yeah, yeah, you're going to have to wish us a bit of luck on this one because, yeah. It's a brand new awning. We've never put it up before. So. We, we don't work well putting awnings up. <laughs> but if Not together. If you'd seen it in a previous video, we bought an Isabella awning. So we're going to whack that up tomorrow. And then I'm going to show you around the awning and show you what we do because it will stop up all season. The last awning we had up. It had stayed up all season, 50, 60 mile an hour winds. Mm -hmm. So we do extra things rather than just the basic awning. But I'll show you around the awning to show you exactly what we do to make sure it stops up in the highest winds. Um, so yeah, it's, uh, can't wait. Can't Love wait. To get the awning up. Got the van outside. I've got all the furniture in there. So we'll see you in the morning. So as you can see the awning is all up, we've added this strap over the top, storm strap, it's got one over the top, one here, one down in the middle and one at that end and the pegs we've got in at the corners and in the middle are uh, homemade and are two foot long so I'll just take you in for a look round. Oh, it's blustery out there. So as you can see, the cooking area is here. We've got kettle, we've got a coffee machine, we've got an uh, induction knob, George Foreman. And what we've done is, we put these extra roof poles in. Because originally it had five, we put nine in. Extra poles here. It's all nice and rigid. See where the straps come onto here, onto the frame. To hold it down because we get uh, eye winds here. We've got a couple of sofas we picked up off of Facebook, um, picked them up cheap so if they last the season out. Now we didn't bring the TV stand so currently we're using the spare fridge, we've got the telly, we've got a heater for when it gets cold. So yeah, this is our little setup. Dog's down there, he loves it. So this is the bargain awning we bought from eBay. Uh, it's cost us £395, it was brand new, been up in a showroom, a caravan showroom, so yeah. And that's the uh, strap on that centre pole holding that down. And I've driven a big piece of steel into the floor there. So yeah, we've got his bikes here as well, Zach's bikes out there. So yeah. So now we're going to chill out for the afternoon. And then I think maybe tomorrow morning we might go down the beach. Cheers guys, it's a well known fact that you have to have beers while erecting an awning, it's a pure fact, all campsites should do this, it really helps with putting awnings up, it relaxes you, there was actually no falling out today which was absolutely fantastic, because normally we fall out doing it, as you can see from the video we had quite a few helpers, I think there was, uh, we had Stuart, Mr Steve from over there, uh, we had Jim from next door, he came and helped, so it was absolutely brilliant, because it was a bit windy so it really does help to have a few hands to hold it down while you're getting it all fitted out. Morning guys, so we thought we'd take you down the beach this morning before we head off home. There's the troops. It's a glorious morning, it's t-shirt weather down here. I think it's only 12, 14 degrees but we don't mind. It's certainly not coat weather, it's absolutely glorious. So we'll take you for a little look round the beach.
So we hope you enjoyed this week's video, something a little bit different, erecting an awning without getting divorced. Yep, didn't need the paperwork. A nice beautiful beach walk. Tad chilly. Tad chilly but it's not It's not too bad to be fair. It's a glorious day. Absolutely glorious it is. Um, next week we've got something a bit different, um, we're going to Shrewsbury with some other YouTubers so you definitely want to keep an eye out for that video. It'll be a good weekend. Because it's going to be a right laugh, there's going to be plenty <laughs> of drinking. Oh yes. Um, plenty of fun, plenty of games and hopefully plenty of footage. <laughs> so thanks again for watching. Thank you. And we'll see you in the next one.